you know, and now I, you see, now I'm already at the contents. This is about the book and this is the contents. Just to go, in, just to go through and walk you through some of these uh, parts and sections and chapters. Okay, so this is the uh, general introduction. Okay. It's very easy to get it, pick it up. And if you want to download, just download it quickly. Okay. And here it goes. This is a short version, that's why it's easier. There are uh, major portions here that will take a while to, uh, to download. Now, uh, we can also go to uh, the biology of the rice diseases just to go, you, just to go through here. Okay, for example, the foliar diseases. As you see, there are many of these foliar diseases uh, that have been uh, included in this uh, chapter. So you will see here, okay, I will just go through and browse through it. This is uh, the brown spot. Easily you will find this in many uh, rainfed environments, even uplands, where water is limiting and nutrient is not uh, is a problem. Okay? Of course, brown spot, and they also uh, cause, uh, uh, they also infect the seeds, okay? And, and bring down the quality of the uh, seeds, okay? Some more studies done, these are the polydia, okay, very quickly, I'll just go, oops, I think too quickly. Okay, and then uh, more on brown spot. But then uh, can, if I want to go through, for example, blast. Uh, I think it's on uh, page uh, 45 here. Still loading. It takes a while. <laughs> Sorry. It takes a little while. Citations are also there, okay, the references. So this is BLAST. This is one of the uh, bigger chapters here, or sections. You'll find that there's up until the end, so it almost covers half of this uh, chapter. And uh, I won't go through individually, but here you will also see some of the earlier work on uh, BLAST. See, this is the micrograph. And there's a quick, uh, oops, sorry, quick uh, life cycle, this is cycle here. <coughs> okay, and, and probably could still be improved, okay. This is the habit character of the pathogen on uh, showing the collegial form, okay. And probably I just uh, go through that. I will not download this anymore because it will take a while to download this. So this is the end of the uh, chapter. So maybe I should close this one and go to another chapter. Okay, on bacterial diseases. Okay. So introduction, very quickly going through. Okay. And uh, we can also go through uh, some of this. We can also go through polyar bacterial diseases. very quickly and then make a bacterial light there. You'll hear a lot of that uh, in this session. Okay, I'll close that one. So you can download it if you are interested. These are on virus and even phytoplasma diseases. So these are the very common problem in Asia, Indonesia and the Philippines particularly are the uh, leafhopper borne virus diseases. Okay. About by vector by the leaf hoppers. Okay, here. This is the uh, purified uh, virus particles, as you see here. During the time of uh, purified, uh, especially during the time of Dr. Ibino. Okay. Yeah. okay, maybe I should uh, close this one and then go to the other sections. Okay, molecular biology of uh, rice diseases. From Dr. Uh, Jin Ling Liu and Dr. William Wang. 
Okay. So introduction about the uh, molecular genetics of disease resistance. Okay, indicating a lot of uh, either showing specific or non-specific type of diseases, particularly for glass. Showing the models, okay, generic epidemiological model, okay, the hypothesis why these models are uh, used. Okay, the uh, types of uh, disease curves, okay, shapes of progress curves, okay, and the uh, structure of epirise, you find this is a lot of applications in many of the research that are available now, published uh, recently on uh, blast, bacterial blight. Uh, they've done a lot of this using FRIs, even in Africa. Okay, a lot of these uh, algorithms. Okay, so. Okay, that's, that's the end. Now, uh, probably I should. Uh, Turn this over to uh, 